to start off by saying um, my next patient is scheduled in 10 minutes, so we'll have to be quick today. Ugh, okay. Oh, uh, I, I kind of got a lot to, to tell you. Okay. Um, first of all, I will tell you about my, my background. Um, uh, I was in a, been a, abused since I was a kid. Yeah, I read, I read about the stuff you've been through. It sounds so hard. Yeah. Yeah, it's it's terrible, mm -hmm. and so like you know, um, I've just been you know involved with a lot of bad people in my life and stuff. And uh, my ex uh, sexually abused me, and he spread rumors about me sex. What is it? Uh, revenge porn or whatever. What ex is this? Uh, my first ex in high school, my ex high school sweetheart. Okay, he's so, still doing it right now? No, that's years ago, but this is what the main cause of it and everything gotcha, too, so. Gotcha. Okay, I'm so sorry. that's kind of, yeah, I know, it's, it's awful, yeah. So anyway, you know, I got I developed PTSD, anxiety through all that stuff mm -hmm. and everything, so that's just kind of a quick background on that yeah, one. And I, I read up on all that, okay, so I know so, all Yeah, and then um, also too, I wrote down my notes so I won't forget anything. Okay. And then the, the main problem that I'm going through right now is that um, I have a ex-boyfriend from, well not an ex-boyfriend, I never even met him in person, but he's overseas and he keeps spamming my email. And so like, you know, it's it's continuous and, and he won't stop. Okay. So I kind of want to get some help trying to see if I can get a police report, report oh, to the I FBI see. and you all that stuff. With a social worker or no, not yet. I haven't oh. talked to them. So, I saw that uh, it in, looked like Carelinks got hooked up with you. Yeah, I never heard back yeah, from them. Yeah, I never heard back program. from them what's going on. Okay. And seeing I'm in the process of moving again because mm -hmm. this is going to be my third time in four months. But you have a good phone number that they can reach you at? Um, actually, you know what? I think that's the reason why they haven't got a hold of me is because I figured that my number was wrong. And I was Let wondering. Me put in your new phone number. Let's I see. was wondering why. I wasn't receiving my phone calls and I had the it was kind of like a, um yeah that's kind of basically what's going on and stuff I mean just you're gonna so getting kinda you like the a, social support getting you someone who can help you make the file make the file and, and yeah report it yeah yeah in terms of psychiatric medicines are those medicines that you're getting from us working okay um yeah good, as far good. as I know but sometimes um I get my brain feels overloaded sometimes mm -hmm. Because, like, I don't know, it's like some s scary like thoughts. Russian, 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 yeah, Russian. scary thoughts. Um, I don't know why I'm attracted to, like, weird, um, uh, demented natures, like, videos and stuff. Okay. I, I don't know if you ever heard of the deep web. Um, tell me about it. The deep web is, like, um, somewhere, like, it's like uh, the... The lower level of the internet is like index pages that are not published on the regular internet. Okay, okay. And it's like a place for like crackheads. Um, so I there's mean, like some dark twisted yeah, stuff. Yeah, very, very twisted. I never like, want to go there. For whatever reason you're drawn to it. I'm drawn to it, but I would never go to like the illegal links. Good, illegal good. Links. So you would Stay watch out of trouble. but you would never put Yeah, I only have my limit. I can't see blood or gore or anything like that because it haunts my mind. Okay. But I don't know why I'm attracted to it. It's just... It's just, I'm just curious, but I'll never, never go down to anything okay. illegal to get myself into trouble. So with the with the medicines that you get from us, because that's what my role will be today, I'll also talk with the CareLinks people and let them know this is your new phone number. Can you please contact her because she needs some social yeah, support? Yeah, because I kind of need somewhere where I have a counselor because I have a really, really good goal, but I just find myself procrastinating a lot. You don't have a counselor right now? I don't oh, have a counselor. Okay. I need a counselor. Okay. I need someone to help me set my goals and, you know, good, good. achieve no, step agree. by step. I think that's important. So getting you a counselor, talking to CareLinks so that they can get you the social support, and then medicine-wise, you take the Seroquel and the Escitalopram? Escitalopram is Lexapro. Yeah, and then Seroquel and then Metformin to prevent diabetes. Okay. I'm not diabetic, but it's just to prevent it. Are you it. taking two tablets of Lexapro or just one? Just one. Okay, because I saw an old order for like a five milligram. I'm going to get Oh, yeah, yeah. That's um, old. That's yeah, old. that's old. Just do the oh. 20. I'm doing good with perfect, that. Perfect. So we'll keep you at the 20. That's a good dose. With the Seroquel, do you want that dose to bump up a tiny bit to see if that helps kind of With the scary bring feelings. down the scary feelings? And bring um, stuff down? Do you take it at night or in the morning? I take it at night. It makes good, me fall asleep because if I don't have it at night, I can't sleep at all. In the morning, all. are you super tired or droggy? Yeah, I I can't get up. So that's when, the reason why I haven't been able to make my appointments is because when, that Seroquel is just I see. too strong for me. So what if we like split the dose and turned it into like a... Like a 
200 at night and then like a 100 during the day that might help i'd rather just stick to the just at night yeah just okay. at night because if i if i uh take it during the day it's probably going to make me You'll feel make even tired, tired. Oh, yeah okay well then let's do that i'll renew those orders and again i'm so sorry that today's a sh yeah, I minutes. guess for the next appointment, I guess I could just tell you everything that I wrote down here. Yeah. That we're a little bit more time and sure. stuff. Okay. Sure. And then we can get to know each other a little better. And yeah. Can, because I, I don't, I hate how sh these appointments are only thirty minutes long, but that we started at twenty minutes late. So yeah, I know. I know. See, but, that's the reason why the Sarah code does like. Yeah. So we don't want to. We don't want to. Yeah. Knock you out. <laughs> but I think your ideas are great to get a counselor get connected with our social worker that that ball's already rolling when will i be able to see a, a social worker or care links because um i'm in a process of moving again this is going to yeah, be my yeah. third time in I, would, I would call them or actually i'll tell them to call you yeah. because i see a note here let me pull it up uh, do, 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 do. there's a note that says miranda hazel will be your care links person. Does that name sound familiar? Um, I don't know. I know some girls just came to my house to get a okay. signature. That's and that, was, that was a whole month ago. Yeah. And so I'll talk to them and give them your new phone number because I bet you they can't reach you because of the Yeah, remote. yeah. So tell me the number one more time just so I make okay, sure. It's five, okay, it's okay. So cool. let me go talk with my attendant. Okay. Do you have a, a form? Oh, yeah. I'll let them know that we're keeping the meds the same, but we're interested in getting counseling and uh, social work. And a longer interview for the next Oh, of course, yeah. of course. Okay. Yeah. But I would say next time, try to come like nope. 30 minutes early so that if you are running late, we'll have that full time. So okay, talk okay. Today. Yeah. Um, I'm yeah. glad I got to see you a little bit. I it's know. Better than nothing. It's better than nothing. Yeah. Um, and let's see, let's see. Are you staying safe? Yeah. Okay. At home, is anyone trying to get you or anyone after you other than, um, wait, you said it's not happening anymore, the stuff about the ex-boyfriend, or is there something? Oh, no, that was, well, the ex-boyfriend from overseas that keeps spamming my email. The one you haven't met yet who's yeah. been harassing you electronically. Oh, For three oh, years. That's too long. That's too long. All right, my friend, let me step out. I'll be right back. Okay. And... We'll get you scheduled. Okay, for okay, one. thank you. Okay. Thank you. No problem, thank you. Some people are more sensitive to these mysterious electronic impulses than others. These uh, unfortunate, sensitive people will at times feel a strange, tingling sensation. Others will feel it less strongly. Don't be alarmed, you can protect yourself. At any time you are conscious of a tingling sensation, you may obtain immediate relief by screaming. Don't be embarrassed about opening your mouth and letting rip with all you've got, because the person in the seat right next to you will probably be screaming too. Remember this, you scream at the right time. It may save your life.